Deep within the heart of Diani Kenya, we embark on an unforgettable epic adventure at the incredible Bora Bora Wildlife Park. Imagine having giraffes, buffaloes, wild boars, zebras, ostriches, crocodiles, tortoises, and other beautiful animals all in one place. But that is not all. This isn't just a regular zoo. It's a cultural and wildlife extravaganza. Here, you get to learn about the Maasai and the Roma culture while uncovering the mysteries of this wildlife saga. Allow us to show you in just under 10 minutes what took us countless hours and effort to put together for you. With each animal having a tale to tell, this is an adventure you won't want to miss. But before you meet the animals, let's explore the internationally known Maasai culture which is rich in tradition, vibrant colors and heritage. Before you ask how the Maasai live, here are the beautiful Maasai Manyata homes, famously known as the Enkaji. The Enkaji are timeless pieces of art crafted with locally available materials like wood, mud, and even cow dung. The Enkaji come in various sizes, serving different purposes. The family hut, for instance, is where the closely knit Maasai families sleep. These round and cozy houses have sections for sleeping, cooking, and storing treasures like milk, blood, and essentials. Right in the heart of the Maasai homestead, there is a central fire pit in the Eshena. It's not just for cooking, it's where stories are shared, laughter fills the air, and warmth comforts the Maasai through the night. But you cannot talk of the Maasai without talking of their dazzling ornaments. The Maasai are renowned for their colorful beads, cowrie shells, and various ornaments that hold cultural and symbolic significance. It's like wearing a piece of history around their necks. It's now time to go from home to the wild. Our first stop is the Terrapin World, where we meet a magnificent 14-year-old female Terrapin and a companion, a sprightly 7-year-old male Terrapin. But how do you tell them apart? First up is the tail. The males boast longer and thicker tails, while the females rock short petite tails. The male Terrapin's bottom part of the shell also curves inside, a concave plastron which perfectly fits with the female's flat plastron during mating. The next animal we have in store for you is the fearsome African predator, nature's ultimate killing machine, the crocodiles. Before we dive into the crocodile kingdom, you might want to check out our Mamba Village video to know more about the Nile crocodiles, from the characteristics to jaw-dropping details. For more feeding action, you don't want to miss our Halapak video where the ferocious crocodiles can be seen feeding. Each video has its unique feel and flavor, so make sure you watch them. But for now, stay with us on this thrilling adventure. Once properly fed, crocodiles can go without a meal for three months. Next up is a date with the charismatic Maasai ostriches, the largest omnivorous birds on earth who can grow to impressive heights of up to 2.7 meters. Adult male ostriches are generally larger and heavier than females. Just like most birds, the males boast striking black feathers adorned with white accents on their wings and tail, while the females sport a dull appearance. When it comes to family, Maasai ostriches have an interesting division of labor. The females take charge of keeping safe and incubating their precious eggs during the day, while the males play garden at night. Next up is the adorable wild boars. The boars have a sticky bill with a broad barrel-shaped body which is covered in coarse and bristly hair. The hair ranges in color from dark brown to black or even gray, making them real chameleons of the animal kingdom. Boas are known to eat everything from roots and tubers to fruits, nuts, insects, and even small vertebrates. On our way, we stumbled upon a dynamic duo that's redefining partnerships and teamwork, the dung rolling beetles. These tiny powerhouses are all about rolling dung. This adventure is just getting started. Before you continue, kindly hit that like, share, notification bell, subscribe button, and turn on the notifications. Kindly support our channel by joining our community for more thrilling vlogs. Our next stop is to the oasis of color. Meet the vibrant peacocks and the elegant peahens. Their plumage is a masterpiece of nature's artistry. Peafalls, commonly known as peacocks, are the males. The females are known as peahens. Peacocks are visually attractive 
they possess a crown of feathers atop their heads that can be raised and fanned out during mesmerizing courtship rituals. Their prized possession, however, is the rainbow tail like feathers known as train, which has hues of blue, green, and so gold. After how long the PA spot more subdued shades of brown, grey, and cream, and generally have shorter and less elaborate tail feathers. It's now time to get up close and personal with the quacky warthogs who coexist in perfect harmony with the majestic zebras. Warthogs have stocky bodies, short legs, and a relatively small head with tough skin. They may look like the comedians of the animal kingdom, but don't let their parents fool you. Their tough protective facial shields serve as shields during fights. Warthogs are also known for their serious dental bling, their tusks. Males spot larger and more curved tusks, while the ladies spot smaller and stricter tusks. It is now time to visit the iconic creatures of the African savanna. These are the only residents who wear striking black and white stripes at all times, notwithstanding the occasion. Although these spectacular stripes may look similar, each zebra's coat pattern is as unique as a human fingerprint. Despite their resemblance, the male and female zebras have no significant differences in color, appearance, or size. Zebras are known for their social nature and their tight-knit groups called harems. When it comes to dining, zebras are true herbivores. They feed on grass and other plant delights. It's time to slow down and meet the leopard tortoise, who are the steady champions of the animal kingdom. These tortoises are named after their striking shell patterns that resemble the spots of a leopard. Despite the name leopard, these tortoises are completely herbivores. The leopard tortoise shells come in a range of colors and intensity, from light to dark spots. Although it is a bit of a challenge to differentiate between the males and the females, we did differentiate them. After a successful round of mating, female leopard tortoises are known to carefully lay their eggs in shallow nests dug in sandy soil. To see tortoises in more non-restricted surroundings, kindly check out our Halapak video. Also, check out our Boko Boko Porini restaurant video for more. It is now time to venture down the enchanting Kipepeo nature trail where we hope to find and meet the majestic towering savanna giraffes. Along the way, we gather branches so that we can easily connect with the giraffes when we come across them. The giraffes are herbivorous animals known to eat leaves, birds, and twigs, especially from the tall acacia trees. Our path leads us through a captivating landscape and special find, the giraffe's bedroom, where the giraffes are said to sleep while standing or occasionally while sitting down. Our guide informs us that the giraffes enter a state of rest when they bend their necks backwards and rest their heads on their hips or thighs. Their sleep cycles are short. Typically, they nap for just a few minutes, and over the course of a day, they accumulate only around 20 to 30 minutes of sleep. Unfortunately, we were not lucky enough to see this. We continue our journey following the giraffe trail on the ground, tracking their hoof prints until we come across one. The giraffes are naturally curious beings, often intrigued by new objects and situations. Despite being cautious, they are very approachable and charming, yet also dangerous. Their long legs and neck are not just for dining, they are formidable weapons, a single kick can be fatal. We were lucky enough to feed the giraffes. You should probably visit the park to experience the feeling. As a special treat, giraffes are sometimes fed nutrients, placed in man-made structures high above the ground. It's a VIP dining experience for our long-necked friends. Our journey brings us face to face with the formidable buffaloes, one of the most dangerous creatures in Africa. These animals belong to the Big Five group, the most sought-after animals in Kenya. These are no ordinary grazers. They are a powerful and unpredictable true force of nature, hence the reason we can only observe them from a respectful distance, ensuring both their safety and ours. It is now time to experience the Duruma culture. This journey is not just about wildlife. Bora Bora Wildlife Park celebrates another local culture too. Prepare to be blown away by the electrifying Duruma dance performers. The rhythm is infectious. It's a celebration of culture and dance you won't want to miss.
As we continue our discoveries, it is now time to look up and zoom. Can you spot a unique tree right in the middle of a pond? This is a tree that's just not a tree. It's a bustling bird paradise with bird nests perched high in its branches. This bustling bird paradise is like a symphony of nature. In this bird concert, the bird's sounds are akin to listening to Mother Nature's orchestra being played live in a man-made pond. This pond harbors other secrets too. It is a home to the tilapia, mudfish, Egyptian geese, and other bird species. While making our way to the tents, we came across the Egyptian geese, known for their noisy honking calls that are often described as loud and melodious. These birds have a striking appearance with brown plumage on their body. Apart from the fact that they know how to make themselves heard, these birds are true romantics. Egyptian geese are monogamous birds that build their nests close to water bodies where they embark on incredible journeys of parenthood. Both the males and females share the duties of incubation. These birds are not just charming, they are fierce defenders of their turf. We are talking territorial battles and epic showdowns. We are talking of real action in the feathered world. Egyptian geese are fearless when it comes to protecting their families. Bora Bora Sanctuary Park has tents. You can actually camp right here in the park and enjoy your stay. The tents make it a home away from home amidst the wild. They are more than just shelters. They are your base camp for exploring this incredible journey. In the tent, you will find a super comfy bed with all the needed facilities to give you comfort as you enjoy your vacation. When feeling hungry, the park has you covered. The Bora Bora restaurant serves up tasty delights, which you should come visit and enjoy its tasty safari explosion. Just to say the restaurant has swings to remind you that you always need to find time to play and enjoy. Although difficult, life is not to be taken that seriously. Before you leave this paradise, there is one more place you must explore, the curio shop. From unique souvenirs to handmade treasures, it's a haven for all things wild and wonderful. Our journey through the Bora Bora Wildlife Park has been nothing short of legendary. From the heartwarming encounters with the wildlife to the electric cultural performances, this place defines ecotourism at its finest. Before we wrap up this epic journey, let us know from the comment section if this experience has been worth the watch. If you have ever been to a nature sanctuary, kindly also share your wild experiences. Let's turn this comment section into a nature's lover's paradise. Also, do not forget to smash that like, share, notification bell and subscribe button to join us for more thrilling vlogs. Before you go, check out our travel and lifestyle playlist for more exciting videos like this one. Until next time, keep exploring and keep making memories. See you on the next adventure and thanks for watching. Ya,